questo piano. Yasas! Today we will be making stuffed eggplant. Papuzaki, which means little shoe in Greek. These are baby eggplants, okay? I've cut off the top part and I've peeled just one line down the middle, okay? Because the first step is to saute them and get them nice and soft before we bake them in the oven, okay? So we're preparing our meal. The first thing we're gonna do is we will have six baby eggplants for two each for each family member, for a family of four. Two will suffice for the meal. We'll have three tomatoes, one big onion, cremidi, tomates, a uh, bunch of parsley here, that fresh parsley. We'll be using some of that. And about four to five garlic cloves, some olive oil, alati and piperi, salt and pepper. Okay, so the first step was getting these cleaned, okay, because these are fresh baby eggplants, stripping down the line, stripping down the line, okay, and taking off the top, okay, and then we're putting them in here with three tablespoons of olive oil so they can saute at a medium heat and really start to really start to get soft, okay? So that is the first step. Okay, cigarizo, I'm sauteing. Okay, sotaro, cigarizo, the eggplant, for about a good three to four minutes. In the Greek cuisine, eggplants certainly take a center stage. They are produced in Greece they have a light purplish color, as opposed to in America where they're darker. Um, they have the same taste and they are used for many, many Greek dishes, such as papuzakia that we're making today, and melizano salata. They are called melizanes, melizanes. Um, and it comes from their dark purple color. So the first thing, because this is a Mediterranean vegetarian meal, we are not adding, there is a variation where you can add some meat, but we are only adding um, vegetables. So we have our onion and what the way that we're cutting our onion is we're just cutting like medium sized pieces like um, kivakia here. And it depends if you wanna, if you wanna cut them smaller um, or larger, they will probably shrivel and melt a little bit in the paputsaki not too big uh, chunks of your onion. So something else that is a key ingredient for the end of our meal is some feta cheese sprinkled on top of your little shoe, your paputaki, okay? So the first, the other thing that we're doing with these onions and the garlic cloves are ready as well, um, we'll cut, a little bit of the garlic. The garlic we're gonna mince up into little pieces, okay? So we can mince it up into little pieces. Scordo. And something that we're gonna do with all of this mix is we're gonna put salt and pepper, um, garlic and onion, and we are gonna saute it with olive oil, okay? This is gonna be our mix. Our tomatoes will be grated, but they will be put on top at the end, okay? So first, we're gonna get this mix ready so we can saute. Um, also adding in parsley. So let's add some parsley in there as well. Okay, some fresh parsley. So I am cutting it, chiffonade. I want to just cut the pieces a little bit, take the stem off um, so it's not in our meal. Get some olive oil in our pan. These are ready to go. Get some olive oil in our pan. I would say just Put an amount that is um, that fills the bottom part of your pan. Okay, it's going to be at a medium heat, medium to low. 
So we can begin sauteing this as well. Let's see how easy. I've added one full teaspoon of salt, alati, and I'm going to add uh, half a teaspoon of piperi. Okay, we've sauteed our melizanes. Okay, they're ready. We're cutting a line right down in the middle. Okay, we're cutting a line right down in the middle. Not all the way down. We're just gonna open it up a little bit like this. Okay, this one was open a little bit more. See how it's tender now? Okay, open it a little bit more. Take our melizana, our baby eggplant. Okay, and then our onions and garlic, gordo, cremidi, salt, pepper, they are all getting. Okay, so they will be in here. Preheat your oven at 350. And once we have our stuffing ready, we'll put it in here and it will cook in the oven for 15 minutes. So what's happening over here is this is, it's got plenty of olive oil and this is our mix, okay? We have some parsley, we have onions, and we have one big onion, and then we have four garlic cloves. This is our stuffing mix. Now, this has been on for about mm, four or five minutes, and it's been sauteing at a medium heat. I am going to put half of my three tomatoes that I grated in here, and I will use the other half for later, along with my feta cheese. So I'll mix that in here now, and let it saute for another three, four minutes. So I've taken my uh, stuffing mix and I've already started putting it in to my baby eggplant. As you see, I'm placing it in there like that. Now this stuffing is vegetarian. The other versions you can do is you can add minced beef, minced lamb, whatever type of meat you would like. Okay, so this is just our vegetarian version. Okay, so we have our parsley, onion, tomato, garlic, plenty of garlic. Okay, All right, and then I have a piece of feta cheese which I can just sprinkle, cut on a little bit, and sprinkle it on like that, like so. I can actually put some, place some in, okay? This will get cooked as well. So this will be in the oven for a good 20 minutes, just as so. Okay. I'm also adding a little bit of my tomato, because remember I told you we're gonna have the other half of the tomato. Possibly sprinkle some more feta cheese on top. Thank you, meal is ready. Carly Orexi.